second generation Ram 2500 uh, Cummins 24 valve turbo diesel from our friend John Mayhe out of Pennsylvania. Uh, just got the truck here, gave it a quick rinse down and took it for its first shakedown run. It's uh, all there, man. All original paint. Everything's original on the truck. It's got a 35 inch set of Pro Comp tires on aluminum rims with a uh, four inch lift, uh, fender flares. It has a bully dog chip with uh, um, a, uh, what's it called? Uh, pretty nice original truck. Good, good work truck, four wheel drive. It's got a six inch exhaust all the way back. How's it sound, Ron? Sounds pretty good. What are your, what are your thoughts on the truck, Ron? My thoughts are, I mean, it's a Cummins. If you don't like the over the road truck sound, then something, you lost your mind. This it sounds, sounds like good. a real truck, don't it? Hell yeah. <laughs> we, we've got to clean it up. We're going to have to detail it and uh, put a new bumper on it. The bumper's dented. Um, it's got a nice bed liner on it. Inside the bed's nice and clean. It's missing a trim piece around the handle, but we're going to go right through it and uh, give the Kaplan touch here. And uh, the, uh, back on this side, uh, James is bringing that tonight. That's uh, the spare tire, but it's a brand new spare. Get it all dialed up. These are absolutely bulletproof. My friend Larry's got one of these with 390,000 miles on it. He's on the like six transmission. This one has a uh, uh, bullet. Bulletproof $4,000 training that, that was just installed on it. So um, we'll get her cleaned up. It's a Cummins. And that's a good thing. Original headlights on it. And uh, we're going to probably replace them. They're a little bit yellowed. The original grill's in good shape. The original front bumper is nice. We'll put a new chrome bumper on the rear. Um, I don't know if we're going to end up painting it. Or well, if we did, we'd maybe change, do a color change to black. What do you guys think? Um, it's got a nice stance on it make an excellent uh, work truck or for hauling the dirt bikes to the track or out picking up trucks. Um, I don't think you can go wrong. It's a good court. Ronnie crawled on it uh, all over it. The frame's in nice nice shape, right? Mm -hmm. Frame's in good shape. Just a little surface. Right? Floorboard's nice. That's it. So Detailed undercarriage. We got a brand new set of shocks for the front that came with it along with a new steering shock and uh, what was it? Control arm? Yep. Uh, and pitman arm. And some bushing. So yep. we're going to have uh, probably do, do some of it in house. Have Amy do some of it. It's got these uh, I think these are Pro Comp fender flares, which are in nice shape. Uh -huh. um, so stay tuned. We'll, uh, we'll have her all cleaned up and ready for prime time in no time. It just showed up, so this is the before. Wait for the after. Thanks for watching, and God bless America. Thank you, John. Uh, we really appreciate you helping us up with this truck and all the bikes. We bought, like, I don't know, 18 bikes from John in this truck and a trailer. Um, he's getting, John uh, is downsizing, sold his house, selling his house, moved into a condo, wanted to sell everything. I met him down in Daytona, and uh, he really hooked us up. Uh, Thank you, John. God bless America.